Hey guys, you're not going to tune my amazing up show. It's your boy LJ. Back with the video today. I'm standing here playing some more Roblox. And today we are playing some Blox Fruits. I know, guys, let me pause you right now. Well, actually, for two things, I'm going to pause you. One, I normally don't even play Blox Fruits, guys. I played it a couple of times on my channel, but uh, they were a pretty off topic to what the title actually told, if you guys catch my drift. But um, yeah, I normally play King Peace. You guys know that. I'm max level on King Peace and whatnot. But that's besides the point, guys. Today we're playing Blox Fruits. And uh, the second reason I stopped you is because I got a skin and an announcement that I want to make to you guys. First, I want to say thank you so much for over 4,500 subscribers. I can't believe I actually made that milestone, guys. We're like literally, what are we? 5,500 subscribers away from 10K. That's literally, that's literally insane, guys. Like, I don't think you understand how, how close that is. We're literally grinding out here. So thank you so much for that, guys. Um, another thing I want to say is, as you guys can see above my head here, I got my title for my um, my crew. If you guys want to join, um, I'll leave a link in the description to my Discord server. The only way you guys are going to be able to join this crew is if you guys obviously have a One Piece cosplay skin. As you guys can see right now, I'm cosplaying as my boy Sabo. If you guys don't know who Sabo is, he came in on the Dressarosa arc, which is pretty far into the series of One Piece. So hardcore fans out here will only know what I'm talking about. But uh, yeah, the suit looks pretty accurate to me. Um, I love having the faded face just because it just looks that much more anime. And uh, I don't know if that's a word, but I mean, I just made it a word. So let's let's roll with it. But yeah, if you guys want to join my crew, the only way you get to join is if you go to my Discord server, send me a picture of uh, a well good anime skin that's like from One Piece. I don't want to see this on screen, guys. I just popped up here. Someone tried to join my crew and they only had that on. And I'm gonna just look at you like like I'm gonna look at you like this, bro. Yeah, okay, I think you catch my drift, guys. Like, seriously, I'm just gonna look at you like that, bro. It's not gonna be any words, and you're just gonna have me wasting your time. Okay, guys, without further ado, that's all I wanna talk about right now. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys right now how to get human form V3. Uh, V3 stands for version three. Obviously, you guys know that. Hopefully, you do know that, but if you don't, then whatever. Now, obviously, there are some requirements, you guys, if you haven't already known. You gotta be level 1,000 in order to actually do the quest. And you also have to give Trevor here a fruit worth 1 million belly. Anything above the fruit trimmer is worth 1 million belly. Like I gave him a phoenix fruit, the uh, the firebird fruit. So uh, yeah, that was worth more than 1 uh, million belly. I gave it to him and then he will unlock the door down here that leads to uh, Del Flamingo, which is the quest that you guys are gonna be doing right now. And not really a quest, it's more of a raid because he's so strong, but you can honestly solo it. I've soloed it before. I'm gonna do it again right now. So actually you guys, we're gonna do this right now. You can see my boy Doflamingo, he drops uh, two things. He drops a uh, boat, so you get a swan boat, and then you also get uh, glasses if you're lucky. Now right now I'm in a private server, so obviously the chances for me are probably a lot higher than you would get, but let's go ahead and do this without any more talking guys. Let's go ahead and beat Doflamingo. Also we are, um, we are Sabo cosplay down to the T. As you can see, we even equipped the white hockey that is uh, Im embedded in his arms whenever he gets his hockey. But I just wanted to geek out for a little bit there. Let's go ahead and do this, guys. Probably equip my... Uh... One thing while I'm fighting Del Flamingo right now, guys, I wanna mention, obviously to get version three, you gotta go in chronological order, which means you gotta get version two first. You guys don't know how to get version two i'll leave you a link to uh, a popular uh, youtuber's video his name is axior I'll, let you, I'll send you guys a link there because i already got version two and uh i can't really explain it since i already got it but uh yeah i'll send you a link to get version two so you can actually get version two. But we're wrapping up the fight now we're gonna go ahead and end it off with one of our new moves here and what he's still alive Hmm. I'm gonna end it with pipe so I can get my pipe uh skill up. Wait, he has more HP? Holy smokes. Forgot about that. Awesome. So you guys can see we got uh the swan ship right there. Secret NPC unlocked. Now this part is important. The secret NPC is what is going to allow us to get the uh the quest to get human version three. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys exactly where to go. You just fly over here to uh diamond. And uh, you go to this tree over here, and it's, it's out of sight of the Coliseum, actually. It's on the back of it. And then you go one, two, three steps to the left, and then you walk right in. So you see, I knew it, bro. 
I knew it. CC, I knew it, bro. Anyway, you walk up in here, boys, and then you got this guy here. Now, he's going to give you a quest, and he says, Greetings. Let's begin. I am Aro, a son of Rip Indra. I train those less fortunate than I to channel their hidden strengths. Now, obviously, guys, he's only going to say this to you if you're, uh, you've are you beaten Doflamingo and if you already got version 2. Otherwise, you can't even get into this room to begin with, so let's just forget about that. Yes, child, I know this must be confusing for you, but I have been sent here by the gods to teach those who seek my wisdom in order to make their race abilities stronger. Not really that confusing. You kind of just broke it down to me very simply. Excellent. Talk to me again once you defeat Jeremy, Fajita, and Diamond. So, he's going to tell you guys that you got to do all those quests. You got to defeat three bosses. Um, obviously, guys, we're, we're pros. We can do this on our own, to be honest. So, right now, you see Diamond right here. We're going to go ahead and actually get the quest for all of them. Just because, you know, extra XP never hurt nobody. So, I'm going to go ahead and fly over here real quick to get the quest. See you guys when I'm there. I arrived to the quest giver. He's area one. He's going to give you this Diamond quest. Boom, you accept. 9 million XP. Pretty good stuff. And then we just go ahead and fly back on over to Diamond. I gotta say, man, the visuals for uh, Awaken Flight is so good, man. I love it. I love it so much. But now we're here at Diamond, guys. We're gonna easily solo this guy. We don't even need hockey on. Let's just do it, man. I like this move right here, because watch this. You can chain a combo. It's actually really good. Here we go. I'm gonna do it right now. Flaming. Did you just interrupt me? Flaming Vortex. And then he's in the air. And you go, boom. 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 Ooh, massive combo. He gets stuck in the flames, too. Am I going to lose? Whoa. Hey, man. Hey, man. You can't be soaring all over the place like that. All right, let me get this guy with my, with my uh, pole so I get more mastery. All right. Let's go ahead and whack him one time. Nice, whacked him in the head, got that good mastery. Now, guys, we're going to go ahead and defeat Jeremy. For those of you guys who don't know where Jeremy is, I, I really hope you know where Jeremy is because this, this is a problem if you don't know where he is. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys right now. I got to do is go over here to the, uh, I think it's, I don't know if it's the Swan Pirates. Yeah, yeah, go to Swan Pirates, guys. But, all right, guys, so we successfully made it to area quest number two. Now we're going to go ahead and get this quest called Jeremy. Got to be level 850 in order to do this quest. Obviously, it's not going to be a problem for you, though, since you've already met the level requirements and then some to beat uh, Doflamingo. So, you know, there's that. But let's go ahead and defeat Jeremy. Jeremy is actually, I forget his name, but he's from One Piece. He has the spring spring fruit. Um, shoot, man, I, I feel really bad. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put a picture up. I know what he looks like, but he's actually a foe that turned uh, good or not good. But, you know, he's he's going through the phases of now trying to figure himself out with Luffy and whatnot. But uh, yeah, he's, he's a pretty cool guy. But let's go ahead and do this. Stuff. We're going to beat him as well as we beat um, as, as well as we beat Diamond. Well, let's beat him a little better because Diamond, he almost smacked us against the pavement. Bro. I'm not going to lie. Let's get this guy good, man. Here is the sun in my hands. Massive, bro. Squiggly. Blah. Hey, did you just slide all the way across the map? That's one thing I don't like about the prominence burst move. It just does it does good damage, but it's it, it lasts too far away. That's why I gotta do it directly down like this. I'm gonna see they don't fly anywhere. But if you just start doing it from like a sideways angle or like it's straight on, and it's not like from a downwards aerial attack, then they're just gonna go flying across the map. That's the one thing I really, really dislike about that move. Yeah, it's, it's pretty bad. I, I wish the knockback wasn't so like knockbacky you know like look at this look at this look at him oh what nah bro nah bro nah now you want to withstand my attack and make me like a fool in front of all my people out here i don't appreciate that let, let me do it again let me do it again he hasn't learned yet yeah there we go uh, well mm -hmm. yeah take that you just making a fool of me right now and i i, I can't accept that right now bro last quest we got to do right now is to uh we gotta fight Fajita. Uh Don, not Vegeta. Don't get it twisted. His name's not even Fajita anyway. It just you know, obviously copyright purposes. But uh yeah, his name is actually um uh uh freak man. How did I forget his name already? Dude, the people of One Piece, like the hardcore fans. They're literally going to like chastise me so hard because I should know 
my anime characters and i don't know why i just got stopped by an invisible force like that oh yeah fuji car fuji kata ah dude i know i'm close bro i think it's fuji hata fuji hata i think that's what his name is i'm gonna set a picture right here this is what he looks like he's the gravity man user but uh yeah we gotta fight this guy and we gotta beat him and then after that we're gonna go ahead and talk to the homie one more time at the uh secret npc location but right now we're gonna go ahead and smack the walls out of this man uh pause that came out super wrong don't take it out of context i'm just trying to be cool with my words man he's blind by the way in the anime like i don't know how he even i don't know you know the senses are just a little bit for him but uh yeah it seems like everybody is just withstanding my second move now after i just you know made a big dispute about how how i don't like the knockback and i'm just dodging it I haven't even used my hockey on this guy yet. I don't like using hockey on this place when it's nighttime. It's so dark, and oh my god, I need it because I can't see anything. Bloop! Ooh, direct hit. Actually, I do need my hockey. Whoa! Squeak! Oh, there we go. Look, he went flying now. He's gone. Look at him. Look at him. He's gone. He can't withstand that. Alright, there we go. So we just beat the homie. Uh, Fujihara. I, I, I'm sticking with that name. I think that's his name, bro. All right, so here we are back at the diamond tree. I'm going to nail it first try this time. I'm going to nail it first try. Watch this. We're going to jump, land right here. Boom, watch this. Boom. And then we're going to walk right in. Oh, I knew it, bro. Freaking first try. Let's go. Redemption for the boys. Let's look at that skin one more time, by the way. Just just really take it in, bro. That's, that's Sabo in the flesh, bro. Like, ooh, that is clean. Look at that. Enhance hockey right now clean bro freaking clean all right let's go ahead and talk to this homie right now bro let's talk to this homie right now so we talked to a or you know however you pronounce that let's go ahead and talk to him greetings sir well done i like many toads wait i like many toads before me have used this gift of mine to teach others of course though i charge a cheap price for my craft two million should do it as you guys can see my money down there i'm not really worried about the cost man we are big balling out here so let's go ahead and pay it and boom new title unlocked full power aka full cowling now i'm playing bro jk but yeah now we got some we got human version 3 right now we also got a title now to be honest guys i'm not really sure what human version 3 does uh it's my first time getting it but let me see what let me see if it does something okay it's like my observation hockey isn't any better. I can't see the uh, the factory staff people from here, so it doesn't look like that did anything. Let me see if I can at least uh, Soru from here to like maybe that blue building. Maybe I can like, get more Soru. No, no, it's not. It's not. It doesn't, doesn't do anything like that. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know what. I don't know what it did. I really don't know what it just did. Oh, last resort. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Never mind. As you guys can see. Uh, we just got to go to our inventory on mobile. We can't really see. It doesn't like show us because we have to manually go there because, you know, the screen is too small. But uh, he goes to the last resort. Let's see what this does. Ooh, what is this? Okay. Okay. Oh, that's it. It lasts for like, what, 10? No, not even 10 seconds. Like, what, five seconds? Uh, let's, let's, go to, uh, let's go to somebody over here and see what it does. I'm going to use it with hockey. Let me see my damage with hockey real quick. Boom. So it's like 471. Now let's see what last resort. Oh, okay, it definitely boosts our freaking attack power by a whole bunch. That's that that's what it does. It boosts our attack power. But only for like five seconds. So I don't know. It's 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 cool to have, but it's not really useful. But I mean, hey, we got it, man. That's all I really care about. These are my stats, by the way, if you guys were uh, wondering. But uh, yeah, I'm on level 2,000. No, 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 no. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, cap. I'm on level 1,235 right now. But um, I'm going to be max level shortly, guys. Don't even worry about it. But if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to let me know in the comment section below. Make sure you leave a juicy fat like. And once again, guys, for those of you who want to join my crew, all you got to do is join my Discord server. Send a picture of a well-made One Piece 
a cosplay character doesn't matter from what arc it is as long as they're from one piece and you know they have obviously all of the features that the character has in the show within your character not just one piece of clothing and then just like a default bacon hair uh skin i don't want to see any of that in my crew guys I, that's that's weird that's on some fanboy stuff but yeah guys i'll see you guys in the next video hope you guys did enjoy and i'll see you all around peace have a freaking good day oh well that's gonna be a little more there we go that's that's a lot better.